Right. Hey, welcome to Con Carolina's Television. I'm Bronner, one of your great hosts. Today we're at the fabulous Game Realm here in Salisbury, North Carolina, owned by this dude right here. It's a it's a great place where you can come and play games after you buy them next door at the Comic Mon store. Bring them on over here and play them. Um, we had a huge crowd here today playing games and having a whole bunch of fun. Um, so we're happy to be here and we're happy to bring you a game called um, Unlock. And it's a series of games, really. It's um, they're adventure games, kind of like puzzle solving games. And they're and there's different ones. There's even a Star Wars one. Um, there's Exotic Adventures, which is we're going to play uh, tonight, mm -hmm. uh, which is fabulous. And let me introduce the rest of your hosts there. I mean, let, let me have them introduce themselves. I got this. I got You've this. got this. I'm Ray Franks. Nice to meet you. Uh, we're here to chew bubble gum and play games, and we're all out of bubble gums. I was worried because I didn't have bubble gum. I didn't know that was a requirement, but I'm good now. Um, I'm Rachel. I am another one of the hosts of this, and hopefully you guys will have fun playing along with us. Right, yeah. and we do encourage anytime the audience has maybe a, uh, a helpful hint, if we get stuck, Chime we, in. We're not we encourage you guys to, to shout it out in chat in the chat and um, we'll see if we can't solve this puppy without getting too many hints from the app. Uh, this game has um, got an app that accompanies it. Um, so you have to have the app in order to play the game. But the really cool thing about it is that it does have a tutorial section and you don't even need to crack the directions open. You can play the, the tutorial right out of the box um, which makes it really um, user friendly, mm -hmm. and we uh, we love it that way. So jump right in. Jump right in. Without jump further right ado, in. this is Unlock, and this is Exotic Expedition, and this is um, what is it? Challenge Challengers? Uh, yeah, cha I think Challenger Expedition. It's Challengers the one that's Expedition. got a sort of a Jurassic Park theme to it, or a pre prehistoric theme to it, and it's uh, really like an escape room in a box with you know all the puzzle solving um tidbits of it so to start the game we've got a little card here that i will read to you with my reading glasses <clears throat> a young woman knocks on the door of your pi agency my name is gladys <laughs> ungerton <laughs> gladys i'm the folly guy <laughs> my friend ned has gone missing he, you probably heard about him he is one of the members of professor challenger's expedition they recently returned from the Lost Valley, full of strange creatures. I just received his notebook and this odd message. I don't understand any word of it. Can you please go to the offices of Professor Challenger? If you are true to your reputation, reputation you will need you will bring Ned back to me. So we got to get Ned gotta out get of Ned. the, the uh, Valley of Ned. the Dinosaurs and uh, bring him back. <laughs> Uh, should you accept to help Gladys, take the survival guide, which is this book right here, and it's got some clues in it and some puzzles we got to figure out. Uh, should you accept uh, Gladys's offer, take the survival guide and take card 53. I cut right to it. What do you know? I'm do we good. have to hit start at some point? <laughs> it, it says right here. Then launch the app, select Expedition Challenger Scenario, and press start. Okay. Everybody ready? Yep. Let's do this. Let's get Ned. Bam. All right. So we got 30 minutes. Uh -oh. This is our first uh, puzzle piece. You got to flip this card over. Yeah, flip this card over. Oh, yeah. And this is where we are, starting in the office right here. Okay. So on this card, and I wish we could zoom in a little more, but we can't. Um, so 8, 15, 36, and 42 is what we got to pull out of here. Here, see if we can find so some of this. So those are clues that they're giving us based on where we're at in the room. Uh, that's the only clue I got for you. Uh, you should have... Uh, 42. Okay, 36. 36 is right there. Yep. All right. So here's our deck. We flip can I hold the survival guide? Hey, do that. You're going to need it. Got this. All right. So the card that I have here is... A highly high quality shoehorn and this card here is blue and it has a little puzzle piece in the corner 
which means this card can interact with a red puzzle piece. And they go together. Maybe they do, maybe they don't. When you put those cards together to find out if they actually do something, you're going to add the numbers in the corner. And whatever you add together is the card that you'll pull out of here. If it makes sense, then you've, you've added the right cards together. If it doesn't make sense, then let's go back to the drawing board. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So do we want to put a candle with a shoehorn? Probably not. Okay. No. We we might be going back to the drawing board. <laughs> <several> <laughs> times. Uh so. another possibility is putting the candle to this card, which uh has paper, rock, scissors on it. That might that's gotta mean something. Yeah, that that's might a, that's a game. But the lemon. The lemon throws you off. The lemon. I don't is. know what that's that's about. Okay. And then you also have your oh, yellow oh, oh, card. Oh, oh, oh. The lemon? I don't know. Isn't there something about like, um, like when you were a kid, didn't you write like messages with lemon juice? Oh, there's something. Yes. I know what you're talking about. Uh, also, there so, could be information in here that we might need to kind of flip through and refer right. to. Right. So there's a map. Yeah, there's a map of the Lost Valley. Marshall, Will, and Holly. All right. Um, a routine expedition. And then a bunch of dinosaurs and what they do and eat. Descriptions. And then a message from Ned. Periodic table, a thermometer. And Morse code. And Morse code. Morse code translation. Okay. All right. So we are supposed to guess. So, so this card here is the one it gave us. That's a blue card, right? Right. So but can we add it to that red card to see if the... The candle will make the a message appear. We could try it. We could try. What's or we number? can key it into the hint. <laughs> Off the camera, you, he's adding. adding Hi, Matt. I can do it. <laughs> what does the app say? Eighty-nine. Um, okay, so here, give the app to the smart one down right. there. A I'm just a good-looking one. Yeah, she's a smart one. Okay, so in the app, you have a couple different things that you can do. Uh, you can get a hint on the card that you're, you're questioning. Um, you can key in a code if you need it. You can utilize machines. Um, so for our hint, card 53. 89. So yeah. the hint it gives us for that card says this piece of paper smells like lemon. Hmm. Interesting, isn't it? And there's two hints. So you've got hint number one, well, hint number two. But we don't need to do the hint unless we need a hint. If we do. But we don't do the hint unless we need it. That's my philosophy. How do you feel on <laughs> I'm ambiguous. You tell you're my ambiguous. wife what to do. Okay, so you're going to be and the middleman. I'm middle sitting man. between you two. You also. are going to be the middleman. All right. All right. Uh, well, hint number two. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> you're ruining the game. It's not ruining it. Give okay. you the hint. All right. What's the next hint? Do you get deducted points or anything for hints, or no. they're just free? Just you time. Do. Oh, time. No, I'm just kidding. No, you do not. Oh, yeah, we've wasted five minutes. We, we, we talk. You talk a lot. I do talk a lot. You talk a lot. It's All a right. gift and a curse. All right. So the second hint says a message was written using security ink. A flame could reveal it. Hey. Hey, look at that. Hey. Okay. So now we add. So really together. what I said five minutes ago is applicable today. Okay. Okay. Maybe we're trying to teach the viewers. How oh, play. I see. And she did a good, a good job of pointing out of really good what you suggested. Researcher. Yeah, she a really good researcher for this expedition. <laughs> <laughs> we're all gonna die. We're probably gonna die. I'm gonna we're get eaten by a tyrannosaurus. In an hour, we're gonna be done in <laughs> Jurassic Park. I'm a tasty meal. So putting those two puzzle pieces gives us card number eighty nine. Yes, eighty nine. All 89. right, eighty nine. So yes. Check. So that means I dig through here. And you get card 89. Yeah, because we think it means something. Okay. And it does. It, over. it does. Whoa. All right. <laughs> so rock, paper, scissors is again on this. But there's something new. Right. And there's a compass. Uh, it also has up here uh, symbols that tells us to get rid of these two cards. So okay. those are out of the game. So that's yeah. important. We don't need those anymore. So rock is pointing, uh, is at the north. Scissors to the east. Paper to the west. And, and there's, there's some lots of notes message on here. that I don't think your glasses is going to pick up. <laughs> yeah, we're going to uh, hope that's not important right now. We're going to hope. Hope and pray. <laughs> what's that card? Yeah, what's that? 
The book. The book. An edition of Alice in Wonderland. It's impossible to open this book as long as it bears this combination padlock. So we got to know a combination to get into Okay. This. So that's one of the codes we'll have to put in. So we need a combination. Also, sometimes there is, if you look closely, there could be numbers hidden on these cards. Right. Or other symbols. I don't know. Like that on this thing right one. here? Yeah, look at it real close. Um, yeah, this one has the number 14 in the corner. Okay. What is working? Or the letter. It just spelled out 14 in the corner. In the corner. Um, it says it's a painting. I don't know what that means. Okay. What are those little squiggly things on there? Right. On the book itself, is that a F and a C and then squiggly lines yeah, like water like beside water it? Or... What is F and C? Um, the centigrade in Celsius. Celsius oh, in Fahrenheit. temperature. Fahrenheit. Temperature, yeah. Didn't wasn't there something in the guide that had the thermometer? Hey, I think you're right. Let's see if you can figure it out. Oh, great! <laughs> so um, you, you wanted a survival guide. You got it. What what else is on there? A it, squiggly line. A squiggly squiggly line. Is there like hot right? So what is well, that like? What's hot? The hot. Let me have the painting. What number is that? Fourteen. 14. So fourteen. No. 15, the card. Oh, you're getting a clue again? Yeah. She's getting a hint. I am getting a hint. So <laughs> it says, look closely at the red rectangle. What do you read? 14. 14. We, we've already got yeah. that far. So. Okay. So this is the one card. Put the card in number eight. Get a hint for number eight. Get a, oh, now you want a hint. No, I don't want a hint, actually. <laughs> you want okay. a hint. So Fahrenheit is uh, 212. Wow. And Celsius is, or centigrade, Celsius? Yeah, is 100. Okay. So that's the boiling point for both of them, right? Yeah. So the hint for card number eight says, C in blue is for Celsius, F in red is for Fahrenheit. <laughs> we figured well, that it's out. It's really helping us out here. But there's the second hint. Okay, let's. And against my husband's better judgment, get him she, a second hint. She's going to get another hint. So it says yeah. red is for the boiling temperature. You're on okay. the right path. So 212. Okay. Okay, so we need uh, card eight. We're going to try to solve. I think it's, is it code? The code. Yeah. All right, but it says red is for the boiling temperature, but it doesn't say anything for C. Well, I would say that it's, is C for the freezing temperature then maybe? Zero? Well, it's not maybe the boiling temperature, otherwise they'd both be boiling. 10. Right? Oh, I don't know. Is it one? Is it two one two zero? Two one two because zero. Because if the boiling point of Fahrenheit is two twelve, the freezing point in Celsius is zero. Right. Why two one two, two, one, two zero? No, oh, the padlock unlocks yes. easily. Boom. We are smart. Sometimes. Yeah. Yes. Sometimes. <laughs> so it says take card five. Okay. All right, so we're on the roll. So we're gonna add to our stash here. Yeah, and if you want to play along out there, if you like uh, figure something out before we do, feel free to put it in the comments, and that info will be relayed to us. Yeah, relayed. Okay, so this says get rid of that card. So we're, we're done with Alice in Wonderland. Well, that's well, what we thought. We, we've opened the book. The Alice in Wonderland book is open, and there is a uh, giant rabbit talking to Alice on page thirty-four. But he's on. He's upright. He's upright. He's a yeah. But he is an Alice in Wonderland. That's not. Weird. Oh, that's true. He does walk around. That was like mm -hmm. rabbits. He's are late. Hop for a very important date. Yeah. yeah, I first learned about Alice in Wonderland from uh, that Star Trek episode. Surely. <laughs> yeah. Fun fact. It's a fun fact. Fun fact. Fun. So we still have a painting. All right. Wait, wait, wait. We have a spoon. What's he doing? He's looking like he's wanting to punch Alice. He is going to punch like, Alice. I'm get you, he's girl. like, we're going to blows, bro. Is that so, what he's doing? What card? Yeah. That's card five, right? Is he playing card five? Room? Yeah. So the rabbit has a strange posture. Right. Okay. I think he's what playing. What is it playing? I think he's playing oh. rock. 
paper, scissors, rock. Is he? Oh, or is so... he just like very angry? No, I don't think he wants to punch Alice. I think he's he a nice punch her. Okay, let's assume. Okay, maybe I think he he's like... making a rock to tell us that we need to look for. Is he telling Alice to look north? I don't know what that means. I don't. Yeah, know. I don't know, but the rock is in the north part portion of the compass, right? So, do we need to know what beach rock? Paper beach rock, right? Paper beach rock. So, rock paper is to the west. Is that what it says? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, get a hint. <laughs> <laughs> What's that shoehorn for? I don't know. Let's. Okay. Get a hint. We're so the hint, hint for the shoehorn says the uses of this object seem endless, but the sharp handle should crack open the hardest shells. Okay. Uh -huh. That must be no good. Yeah. No good. Something we haven't found yet. What is this? Let me look at it. Uh, have you gotten a, 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 a hit on five? Yeah, it says the rabbit has a strange posture. Okay. Yeah, that's nothing. Help. Help. Anybody out there in TV land? <laughs> Help. Uh, I know some of these cards are hard to see. but He doesn't think we're going to yeah. escape. Our producer says we're not going anywhere. <laughs> We're stuck. It's um, your fault. Okay. Hmm. So, so this card here says you only have bits of the sentence. What document do you need to form a full message? Oh, is there some, look in the survival guide. See if there's something there. Maybe there's more. Okay, I'm trying to read this. Yes, it's only parts of it. Is is there parts of that's the map? Those are the dinies. So, yeah, it's not helpful. We've done nothing with this one. What is it? What was the hint for it? The this 14 is, thing? Look closely 14. at the red rectangle. What do you read? <gasps> it's a number. Oh, we should have gotten card 14. That's what it is. Good. It's card genius. 14. Because anytime that, that you changes see... the complexion of the entire game. Yeah, because if you see a number on a card, we're supposed to dig in here and get the other thing that doesn't make sense yes it does oh okay there's a coconut behind the painting and that and we've got he, a he just got the hint to beat it open can beat it open you, you we're gonna put those two together <laughs> okay yeah. uh 14 that card says get rid of that that's 56 so 56 so let's get card 56 that. yes you are no smart one because if we're using oh, a shoehorn yes. to beat that open yes we're not looking for we, card 56 are we yeah okay yeah 14 and 42. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. We, we did it. Cracked open the coconut. We, we cracked it. There's the coconut opens in the middle. It holds a mysterious machine. Okay, so that's the symbol for machine. Okay. And so, 56, so we need to put a code. 56. And this is what it brings up. Ah, our so it says latitude and longitude. So we need a direction and two numbers. For latitude, a direction, and two numbers for longitude. Okay. I feel like the rabbit and north is important, right? Yeah. The rabbit had the number on the card, though. Do we get that card? 34. 34. Yeah, page 34. So, and 34? And 34, maybe. Yeah. But then what's the other one? Longitude. What is but that? are we sure it's north? Well, I mean... Well, that's where the rock is. If, if the Unless rabbit... Oh, paper's beach rock. So it's probably W34. But why? Because well, paper beach rock. Okay. Don't we get card 34 now? <gasps> yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you're so smart. Thank you. Thank you. Genius <laughs> over there. Gosh, yes. You I'm like, what they say something. Game. Oh. Okay, okay. This so there's some text. Has a lot of words on it, and it's also got a couple of lines which makes me think that we need to do something like that because that works does it go together it does it does go together okay like grandma can you read lemma, it? Lemma, can lemma, read it? you guys are gonna I'm the only one that doesn't wear glasses great right, right. it happens when you reach a certain plateau when you reach a certain level a certain, it's not an age it's ball. a level <laughs> it's ball you. men of a certain age is that what it means? I'm reading. You can't well, do this. when you reach a certain man of a certain age. Oh. 
when I reach a certain bend. Okay. This volume holds in the form of a diary, the account of four voyage and a few short remarks about natural history and geology that I believe could be of interest to the general public. We need help. Enter both latitude and longitude coordinates. So to be teleported to our valley, save the five of us. We are in great danger. Each coordinate is made of a cardinal point followed by two digits. I will help you with the latitude. It is south. Four minutes and seconds. Look on the lower right side. For the other row, beat the rabbit rabbit, and enter challenger's initials. <laughs> Paper beats the bat. So the latitude is south, and the bottom right corner is the 34. So for the other one, it's, we need to beat the rabbit, and paper beats rabbit. His name is J.E. Challenger. Okay, so that was West to beat the rabbit? Yeah. And then? And then enter Challenger's <laughs> initials. But his initials are letters. We need numbers. J.E. Huh? Uh, is it J? Challenger. G.E. Challenger. Uh, that guy. Wait, that doesn't make sense. So right, G-E. we need numbers. <gasps> Wait, is there code? What the Morse code that's in there? Wait, 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 wait. There's is it Morse code or is it periodic table? There's a well, periodic there's table. Because there's only like there. three things in there that have. We can't find the page. I'm sorry. Um, we lost. We're never getting out of here. Let's see. We can't even get it out of the office. G E. Or what number is that under the G E? Do I have to read that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. I'll be sure to bring my glasses. Okay. So time. you said G E? G E. It's 32. All right. Let's try that. All right. Ready? Yes. Are we we going over the waterfall? Flashes burst out of the machine. The whole room seems to be spinning and you pass out. You wake in the middle of a strange forest. Take card one. Discard 56, 5, 34, and 89. So all of these. All right. Wait, card one? Yeah, pass me the other one. We did it. We're we out of here. We did it. We we're made in, it out of we're, somewhere. We're in somewhere. We're yeah. somewhere. The greatest earthquake ever known. All right, you have teleported to Challenger's basic, well, to his base camp. It's kind of basic. In the Lost Valley, uh, you must find Ned. Lost to Valley. A, oh, yeah. Words. You must find Ned. To obtain a better score, you will have to the opportunity to find and save the other members of the expedition. Their health deteriorates every night. Use the app to indicate your movements and take the shown cards to reconstitute the map. To interact with a card with an anchor, you must be on its space. The other objects are transported with you. Good luck. Be careful. Take card 81. It's the first <laughs> part of the map. So you you can take stuff with you. Is that what I get yeah. from that? Okay. Yeah, there are objects that you can take with you, and the anchors are something that is specific to that location. Examine that thoroughly so that we know if there's any numbers or weird things in there. The the only person that can read will do that. (laughs) Okay. I saw 93 and 45. Yes, 93 and 45. So we've got a tent Hmm. set up. Looks like we're in the forest, but I don't see any lumbers or anything flashy we we also have an empty bottle and some chalk okay all right so on the app (laughs) the app has changed now that we're in the lost valley uh the space that we're in is uncovered and then adjacent to us are spaces that are not uncovered because we haven't explored those yet so we have the option we can go left right or up where do you guys want to go to the top, baby. To the top. Right. We're going to the top. <laughs> then All throw right. me over. So this land is swampy. You are moving slowly. Take card 82. All right. So we have found huge animals that trudge in the marsh. Uh, I need card seven. We got a boot. My boot got stuck in the mud. And we've got... There's a snake in my boot. Oh, this is... Here you go. A rifle. Okay. We got a rifle now. All right. We got a rifle. We got some protection. 
especially if there's dinosaurs tromping around there. So card 82, we've got a boot, a rifle. Absolutely nothing makes sense. Nothing makes sense to me at all. Okay, so the rifle Let's is a machine, which I imagine we could probably, we could probably use to use scare it. off something or whatnot. What did you it just says, put in there? This oh, shotgun hint. will be useful if you are attacked by a dinosaur. Okay. Figured that one out myself. Yeah, right? <laughs> the boot. But I wanted a paring knife. Right? Don't bring a knife to a gunfight or a dinosaur fight. <laughs> <laughs> Only the laces could be useful to you. What could you tie them to? All right. So the boot's no good, but the laces are. Okay. The bottle. Where could you fill this bottle? Okay. So keep at an eye out for water. At the waterfall. Because the waterfall is a fresh And then water. the chalk. Nothing to report. It's not special. <laughs> not special at all. It's just chalk. Oh, but there was a hidden object. What? Where? It flashes on the screen when there's a hidden object. So it makes sense. A number is nope, that's the first one. Look closely at the swamp water. What? The swamp water. What do we see? You don't see anything. No, no, right? <laughs> Neither do you, apparently. <laughs> It's true. Oh, there's a 94. What? I don't... Right at the base of that tree. <clears throat> 94. Oh, good grief. Good eyes. All right. So... I promise you don't need good eyes to play. How much time do you have? You better glasses. <laughs> okay. I My promise. glasses are way over there. And I look. The timer has actually disappeared. That's it bad. says day one. They know we're going to lose. All right. Yeah. We've got probably 30 minutes left. So. They've given up on us. <laughs> They've given up. All right. Leaning against the tree. Roxton speaks incoherently. You must find a way to lower his body temperature or he will die. He apparently is not well. All water. Right. So he's we gotta save him. We need to get him some water. We need we need to we do don't have water. We don't have water. Mm. Mm. Uh let's find some water. All right, let's try Are another section of the map then. Still going north? I think so. Right. Are we? We we gotta well, you tell me. I don't know. Oh, there's a map. <laughs> there's total oh. water. Oh, wow. Oh. There's a map in the survival guide. Go figure. Go figure. <laughs> so, if this is camp, the lake is north. So, keep going north. So, keep going north. We'll get some water yeah. and we'll save this dude. And we'll save Because we this have guy. to save that. We don't have to save him, but it gives, gives us more us points. better score. Let's go. But if we're already running behind on time, then we're really to that, to push north. I'm just saying the only person we're supposed to get is Ned. <laughs> I'm just ne saying. If you, Ned find a, if you find a guy that needs help and you go, well, I don't really have time. Well, he and shouldn't have been there in the first place. The Ned Schneebly references? Anybody? Type so, in the chat. we've gone <laughs> north and it says you arrive on the shore of a huge lake. It is impossible to cross it. Well, we don't want to cross it, but can we fill but, up the water? It is red, so we can add it to the water bottle. Uh, yes, that sounds like something we could do. All right, yeah. So it's usually it goes all the way down to a dangerous, <laughs> to dangerous rapids. Sounds so like fun. Plus Ten plus forty-five is fifty-five. The higher beings just told me that don't drink it, you'll die of dysentery. Well, we got a paddle from the lake, though. <laughs> yep, there's a paddle hiding in the lake. Oh. All right. So ten and forty-five is fifty-five. Okay. 10 and 45 and 50. Do I add those? Yeah. Yes. I'm ready yeah, to add them. Because the lake is a puzzle piece. Yeah. So 55 and 45 is 110. No. <laughs> no. What's 45, wrong with your man? 55 I mean, is 100 love, plus 10. It's so really 110. Hey, we did it. What's in that water? What's in that bottle? A note? I don't know. I don't know. Water, water. probably. All right. You're good. It. So we discard this one, 45. Because it's What's no in the water right? bottle? Mm. What's in the <laughs> Wow. All right. I, there's things swimming around. These guys there. are going to die, and it's our fault. I don't it's know. dysentery. Let's get it back to. Is that Cal. running water, or is that still water? Where's the survival? We probably water? just killed him. Yeah, we're probably just going to give him the bacteria. Okay, so we can't cross the lake, so it put us back in 82, which is where he is. No, he's lives. in 82. Yes, Mr. Ned. So, that, how, how do we give him the water? Uh, you um, add the numbers together 94 and but it's not a puzzle piece it's oh. not. um can you just type in there give oh 
It's not water. He doesn't need water. Oh, oh this you says don't. desert people can help him. So mm. where's the desert? It's over here. So keep going up and then to the right. But we can't go up because the lake's in the way. So we're going to have to go to the right. Go right and then up. Okay. You find yourself in the middle of a very dense forest. You retrace your steps. Oh, that's there. So we go back to the place. We can't get through. Uh Uh-oh. Night is coming. You set up a makeshift camp. So every time night falls, these guys lose lose health. health. Yeah. Uh yeah. Very limited time to save them. Or we go for Ned. I'm just Let's saying. just go to not Ned. We're going to save Challenger, Challenger right? Yeah. He's no. not Ned. She wants us to bring Ned back. She That's doesn't Ned. care about Challenger. Oh, That's she Rockstone. wants to bring Ned? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We're going after Ned. We're going for Ned. Okay. All right. Let's find Ned. Day two. So we can't go to the right. Okay. We'll go to the left. Sounds good. All right. All right. We'll see what we got going on here. A vast lowland is laying in front of you. Take card 52. You got it. Card 52, we got 52. it is. Ooh. It's caribou. Like food. <laughs> and I'm just going to get a hint. <laughs> is that prehistoric caribou? It says nothing to report. A huge deer stands in this lowland. It looks peaceful. Let's shoot it. I'm sure it is. All right. And then there's a rock also in this okay. picture. So that's the one that has the anchor. And so you can interact with that, but you have to be in that space. So gotcha. hit the caribou with the rock. <laughs> you, you can't no, do that. not that kind of game. I don't but it is so. a puzzle piece. So things. Oh, the rock is. Yes. Yes, it is. So. Hey, what if we tried to use the paddle to pry the huge rock? To to whack it at the caribou. Is that what we're doing? Well, I wasn't. What I was maybe okay. we can. What did we break? So there's the rock nothing to we... report on that. We know about this. We haven't checked the paddle. This strong paddle could serve as a lever. Yes, I think yes. you're on the right track. So we'll add those together: forty and thirty-two. Okay. That is seventy-two. Seventy-two. I don't math. I can read. But I don't even need your calculator. No, I forgot. I'm a retail genius. Oh yes. And <laughs> retail. You know, so we can discard those two. Yes. All right. And it says a huge rock wobbles and gives you access to a cave. We found a cave. Oh. It also has an anchor Ooh, it's and it's a machine. Let's check it out. <clears throat> 72. An anchor. No, wait. A hole in the ground is a machine. Yeah. And okay. I typed it in and it went blank. We, you broke the machine. We broke time. <laughs> oh. Hey. I think the volume is off. The volume is off. Well, I need it on. Okay, well, it's on the right-hand side of the iPad. I'm sorry. I didn't know if it was troubling. Oh, neat. What is it? There's like a banging noise. It's like a combination? No, like somebody like knocking on something. Like somebody's trying to get our attention? Right. Well, you've got my attention. Oh, you're closer. Hotter. Hotter. Okay. Hotter. We're going to find somebody. <gasps> we found him. Did it. So awesome. That was the chime. After much roaming, you find Summerlee exhausted but safe. He tells you that Zambo and Malone have disappeared during the battle between the desert and the jungle people. Discard 72. All right. So we cool. Did. Really, really loud. So 72 is gone. 72. Bye-bye, 72. All right. We might actually make it out of here. But that was one of the guys <laughs> we were supposed to find. So we found him. We found him and we saved him. I hope so. I hope so. I hope so, too. Follow us. Oh, right? Come with me if you want to live. <laughs> <laughs> get to the chopper. All right. So are we going yeah. north? So we can go around and get to the yes. desert? Yes, yes. Okay. Okay. Before we go okay. north, though. There's only one thing below us. And what if it's important? Because if we get way up here and then we have to backtrack all the way all down. All the way down. Let's do it now. I think so. I think so, too. You come to a mangrove. Is that like manscaping? <laughs> I'm a mangrove. I'm sure you are. <laughs> Take card 87. All right. Ooh, pterodactyls. Pterodactyls. Those are fun. All right. Anybody know what the definition of a mangrove is? Don't. <laughs> Don't. Not a female growth. 
<laughs> All right, so we've got we found a torch, a torch, Yay. and we found um, a strange creature that's flying, that's playing with a rope. Okay, playing with All a right. rope. Are that you sounds odd? Is it a rope or is it a giant snake? It could be either. It could be either <laughs> at this point. But that's uh, you know, like why would it be playing with a rope? Right. That rope so needs to be obviously. Ours. We need the rope. <laughs> but who's gonna get the rope? From the pterodactyl. I'm not going anywhere near a pterodactyl. All right, what's the hint? Um, <laughs> to recover the rope, you will have to feed this creature. Oh. Why can't we just throw the boot at the creature? I want to hit it with a shotgun, but that's just me. What about we just throw the caribou <laughs> at the pterodactyl and just let, you know, let, you know, Mortal Kombat? <laughs> How do you lead the caribou to the pterodactyl? Do pterodactyls it's an inside eat caribou? Joke, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Okay, so <laughs> according to the survival guide, they eat fish. Oh, no, we don't have fish. We don't have fish. Okay, that's let's go find a fish. Let's find a fish. Okay, but I don't know how we're gonna find a fish. They have things like at the general store, maybe they have a fish finder. A fish finder. If at, you know, I bet you they have rope at the general store too. So <laughs> right. let's just bypass all this. Just the go to the general, go to the general store. store. So we can't do anything here, we'll just keep going. There. They right? can put a machine in a coconut. They can put a fish in a coconut. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> they can put a fish in the boot. All right? All right. So back north we go. All right. right. You Here move slowly. The ground is shaking under your feet. You hear an immense din. That's Take scary. card 29. There's a huge geyser that's periodically Ooh. blasting. It's boiling hot water. Boiling hot water. Yeah. Can we oh. burn the pterodactyl? <laughs> I don't what know. That? But here's the narrow fissure that's in the uh, geyser. Okay. Or beside the geyser. That's a, a It's a machine. Yeah, it's a machine. It is a machine. Let's check it out. There's something. 28? Yeah. Oh, okay. So it's another thing that we got to do actually it's on the a little app. puzzle on the thing. Huh. Are you supposed to be tapping it like that? I tapped the last one. It works. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Dreams do come true. All right, let's turn it off just in case. Nothing. No, I don't gotta be what something. Is, let's look at the hint. What okay. is that, 28? You hear someone sending an SOS. Someone is trapped in Morse this code. rift, but it is impossible to climb down from here. Survival guide, Morse code. Yeah. But I know SOS is. Yeah, like, where were you? But what right kind here. of SOS? Like, help but, oh, me. I just. Uh, oh, there's a fish machine. down here attacking me. Twenty-eight. Could happen. That's SOS. Nothing. Hey, I I hear a ticking, a tapping. Or is that? I wish the music was music, yeah. Right. Maybe you go to settings and mute the music. Probably. Genius. All right. Okay. Certifiable genius. I heard something. Huh. No, but it says it's impossible to climb down. I'm a bet we need the rope. Okay, I'm oh. a bet. <laughs> that would have been a little bit of. It took us like seventy percent of the game to figure out how to turn the music off. We're not gonna save these people. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you were gonna die. <laughs> we're probably gonna die. All right. Eighteen uh, minutes so to save good old Ned. It's okay. We got this. So we're going north. Sure. You arrive in front of a huge cliff. Take card fifty-one. Ned Schneebly. No, it's no, uh -oh. not Stark. Guys, it's day two. All right. Play oh, time. if we're going north, we're going after But we did Stark. save one of the guys. That's true. True. We did something. All right. The faces of the cliff are too steep to be climbed up. And then there's this. 
So there's a cave at the foot of the cliff that can be interacted with uh, with one of the puzzle pieces. Uh, I don't know. Do we want to use the but torch? But we have to be in that location. Aren't we there? We just moved there, didn't we? Yeah. But the torch isn't lit, so it's not going to do us any good. Mm, yeah. Still try it. I mean, what's worse? I'm having? thinking you need to light the torch. And we need a rope to climb up the cliff. Well, can we use the boot lace to climb up the... I'm, <laughs> I'm just thinking out loud. I'm not Don't as judge. light as I used to. Don't judge me. That's not as... Don't Maybe the me. piece of chalk will let us climb up the bridge. Never going camping with you. Okay, whatever. I've been camping with him. <laughs> You're a much better camper than this. It's an adventure when you go. All right, so you. are we going over? Because we can't do anything here. Um, and we got to save this dude. Go over. Go over. Okay, d d before, before we do it, it doesn't hurt to try. Okay. What's 13 and 26? Uh, uh, 39. 39, just in case. Just, just if it if it's not, it just won't be here. No, it's thirty nine. Oh, no, it's not. There's machine. a card here. It's thirty nine. We can look at it if it doesn't make sense. No, no. <laughs> press the penalty. <laughs> we didn't see that. We press the penalty see. button. Yeah, so press. It takes yeah. a minute. All right. It's taking right. more than a minute. Okay. Right. So we'll go over. The heat is becoming stuffy. This arid place seems to be a dinosaur graveyard. Take ninety seven. And that goes here? Okay, yes. Yes. It seems that creatures only come to this desolate place to die. Is okay. that lava? We're going to die. Uh, it could be. We are going to die. It could be. Are we dead yet? Not yet. But we will be. All right, but we get four cards out of this, so that's good. Okay, so that's going to help. We have a small... Claw with a hole in it, like That's it could like go on a, like it go on a shoelace. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. Uh, idea. Skull of a strange creature. I forget what the dinosaur is called. And it's a machine. Uh, stone tools and some uh, some hieroglyphics. Some ruins. <laughs> ruins. Ruins. Okay. Ruins. Hey, what? Do... So what? that's a machine, right? Yeah. So, so let's you key that snap in. it. 35. Maybe it's Flintstone or something. <gasps> okay. Came okay. That's cool. Flintstones. Oh, like, like do it like, yeah. Like, can you make a fire? That's what we need. Run to it do. up and down, up and down. <laughs> no. I have made yeah, yeah. fire. No. You're, okay. You're making fire on the iPod. Uh, it's making a spark. It's, yeah. Like, there's something in the spark. Can you see it? It's probably it's, saying oh, no, wait, no, wait, penalty, penalty. It. Is it 18? Yeah, it says 18. It is 18. Okay, ah. cool. That's pretty so cool. So do we get card 18? Uh, no, because there's not a card 18. <laughs> Are you sure? Uh, yeah. But what if we added 18 and 26? Because we're trying to light yeah. that, Yeah. Right? 18 and 26. Is what? Uh, uh, no, that's high math. A number is a 44? 44. Are you sure? It's yeah. a number. Okay. Look it's for 44. 44. If we get another penalty, it's what not is it? 18 and 6? 18 26. and 26. Yeah, it's 44. All right. Okay. You got it? Oh, Look at card, card 44. Yeah. Do we like This is torch? like the first do fun like thing I get torch? to do all day. <laughs> hey, 44. Uh, hopefully. All right. So 44. Be a torch. torch. Be a torch. It is. It is a torch. All right. So we can just card. Now we can go in the cat. Now we can go in the cave. That one? Yes. Okay. I'm pretty sure that says get rid of that. 35, yeah. Good. <laughs> okay. Let's go to the cave. But now. that's the machine, too. All right. Let's look at it. Let's, you want to play with the machine? Yeah. Do we have time to play with the machine? I don't know. We'll make time. Important. Okay, go ahead. Or do we go back to the cave? Let's do the machine first. Okay. What is it? 19. 19. 19. No, 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 19. Oh. It would like to access the microphone. Okay. I don't know why. Are we going to talk to the machine? Microphone. This is the skull of a that dinosaur. <laughs> Parasilophilus. Parasilophilus. A snuffleupagus. <laughs> snuffleupagus. I like it. Blow into the horn to communicate. <laughs> not my Have iPad. That. I'm not blowing into it. I'll blow. <laughs> yeah. Not blowing into it. 
Do we have to actually blow? It says As blow. Says. <laughs> <laughs> what am I blowing on? I Are you know. lying? You didn't even know how to oh, blow. You're not a very good blower. Are these hands oh, you did powder. it. What? I did it. You did something. You blew into the snuffle up, I guess. Oh, no, you didn't. No, you didn't. Just <laughs> kidding. <laughs> Oh man! Where's the microphone? I was told I had terrible Wee-woo. technique. <laughs> Wee woo! <laughs> Wee woo! I don't think you're doing access to the microphone. I did. <laughs> I don't oh, know. Wee woo! <laughs> I've been married to this woman for like eight years, and I've never heard you say wee woo. Wee woo! Wee woo! I'm not letting you borrow my eyes to read. Can I have an iPad so I could do something with it? Yes, look, it's going to do more than we would. Approach your mouth to the the the, the dude, the, the microphone. Wherever the microphone. Where is the, the microphone iPad. on that? All right. <laughs> <laughs> Don't judge me. <laughs> okay. Ninja. Oh, we will, we will. Ned is going to die. Oh, it worked. You did it. He, You're, he he's a good blower. blower. <laughs> he's God. a good blower. You blow. Thank you. I, I got some really good advice from, <laughs> you know, the people upstairs. <laughs> he said, blow it like a Nintendo cartridge. Oh, yeah. Ah, and okay. Worked. We're all old. That made sense to us. <laughs> you hear heavy steps getting closer. It's the T-Rex. Oh, Don't that's not good. Don't move. I've watched Jurassic Park. This. Don't move. I got this. Don't move. <laughs> You'd be better off not provoking it for the time being. Okay. Oh, let's put this back. That means we're going to have to provoke it later. Can, um, can we do that? I like the idea of putting 16 and 7 together, you, which is 23. You can try it. That, I mean, just look to see I mean, if there's it, a card with those two numbers added together. You know what that is? It's a 23. 23. Oh, I'm mad. And there's a card. Oh, okay. Okay. If it's a penalty. Yeah, it's either going to be, a, you did it. Okay, I liked your, right. your idea, so cool. I just hung on to it for a little bit. You just hang awesome. on to it. All right, so now we can fish. Pterodactyls eat fish. That's what uh, you said, right? Uh, yes. All right, so do 23 and 4. We can't because oh, we have to be there. where the pterodactyl is. But okay. we can carry the fish hook over there. Right, but we okay. have a lit torch. We're going back to the cave. Back to the cave. Hurry, hurry. Hurry, hurry. Okay. Time's a wasting. What is that, 13? Mm-hmm. I'm late. I'm late. Thirteen plus forty-four. Um, yeah. Is there a fifty-seven? Yeah. Uh, All right. Good. All right. What does it say? Uh, it like on a, the cave's wall is a uh, painting. Band of the hand. It's a handprint. It's, it's like a, Wilson. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. <laughs> yeah. All right. It is that's a hand. It. That's all right? it says. It is a hand. Well, yeah, it's a hand. So it says the desert people use these paintings as benchmarks to cross the rapids. What? What? Check out the the map. What is that? It's uh, okay. Wait, wait, wait. There's a hieroglyphic. Recent chalk writing here. This requires a code because it's got the lock symbol. Right. On it. So let's check out 75. Please enter four digits. Okay. So we're going to figure out some four digits. Hmm. What is the, the picture of this? Yeah. Take a look. So it says four rows with nine white symbols. Which one to choose on each row? So the four digit number is going to come from. There's a plus in every. Is there a plus in every? Because there's a plus there, a plus there. There's a picture of all the dudes we got to find. So try six. What is that? Uh, Machine 75 or code 75. Maybe it's the times mark. So seven. Wait, is there an anchor on it? Yes. Mm, yes. So we can only interact with it when okay. we're in that space. Uh, wait, which bummer, dude? Where was this? 75. This is in the cave. That's in no, the cave. It's, huh? it's uh, 97. I can see it from here. 75. Oh, yeah. You're right. Oh, it's in the yeah. where they go to die. 
So do we want to go over here or do we want to figure out what we missed down here? Well, what about fishing for We're the fish? Closer there. And the lake is here. So we could probably fish at the lake. We're going fishing at the lake. I made an executive decision. Oh crap! It's day three. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right. So we're going fishing at the lake. Those prehistoric wolves are off the main. Uh, you suddenly wake up alarmed by raptors' groans. Hurry! You must flee from them. Run away. Does it tell you which way to go, or the you just pick a direction? Raptors surround you. <gasps> let's kill a little shotgun. Uh, let's do that. Do this. Do we want it? Kaboom. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the gunshot scares the raptors and they run away. You can resume your adventure. We're not dead yet. Okay, so we only have two more shots remaining. All right, so fishing at the lake. Why can I not go fishing at the lake? Well, it says a huge lake goes all the way down to dangerous rapids. So maybe we can't get there. Maybe you we have, have to go, go around, around to the it. other side. Great. It's too risky crossing this desert. Look for a path. Oh, pain. So we have to go like. Okay. Well, no, no. While we're here, maybe we should interact with this. Is that something? I'm thinking we can it's do? after the time symbol. They all have a time symbol, and then they all have a number after the time symbol, from what I could see. And there's four rows, and right. each row has. I don't why think we the, have enough information. Why the time symbol there? Why does that matter? There's well, plus symbols on all of them too. Not so all is of it them. like There's this one symbol that doesn't plus. Have a plus? That one does, that one does, that one does, that one does. Okay. Um let me see if anything it's a four digit code. <clears throat> yeah. That's a six. See, that's not a number though. Unless it's eighteen. We got about five minutes. She's gonna go fishing. <laughs> is it nighttime again? So that's seven. Is the times seven zero seven? I have no idea. So what's ten plus twenty three? Thirty three. <laughs> Did we get 33? Get uh, card 33. Thir We're going fishing. Is there a 33 card? Oh, that's how that works. Don't make me look stupid. 33. We didn't. <laughs> Trust me, we didn't. <laughs> we, caught, we caught a fish. Just, you know, a primitive fish. All right. So we give it a 23. All right, All right. We're giving a fish to a pterodactyl. Thank you for being smart, Rachel. What? That was that was very sarcastic. 30. No, it was, that was <laughs> there was no sarcasm sarcastic. in there. Ooh, if like, I ever get lost in the valley of dinosaurs, we're yes, running out of time. Okay. All right, so fish to the uh oh pterodactyl. What happened? <laughs> we set up camp next to some triceratops. What can we do to pass unnoticed? They're sweet, aren't they? Veg aren't they uh, veggie sources? Speech recognition. Okay. Okay. So the app wants us to be able to speak to the dinosaurs. Wow. Oh, dinosaur. Sorry, dude. Just give it a big roar. <laughs> woo, wee woo. Wee woo. 19. 19. It's 19. The little machine we blew into. Uh-huh. Is that we got blowing the machine again? You could try it. Like a Nintendo cartridge. <laughs> you want me to I had Sega. I had you to... slipped through it. You did it, Rachel. Oh, I did it. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> a better blower than I thought. It's that wee woo. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, fish in the pterodactyl. 33 plus 4 is 37. Yep. See, I'm smart too. All right, 37. I'm on it. How many minutes are left? I'll take that much time to find it. <laughs> Just joking. Look. It's a rope. We got a rope. So we need to go the rope down where again? We the were fissure? supposed to climb down. Climb down the fissure? Yeah, well, I don't know. Because well, we that's any, a machine. Like, puzzle pieces to go with it. Mm. So we couldn't get to this one. We couldn't get to this one. Right. I guess we have to go there. 
Yeah. What's the the bottle for? We got that early on and we're still carrying it around. Well, we're in a dense forest and we retrace our steps. Wait, what? So we can't get to any of those three. I think we have to go back up to the the, the fissure. Okay. We'll do it in, in an expedited motion. <laughs> We've got like two minutes. All right. All right. So we're here, which is the geyser. The geyser's there. Uh, wait, can we combine the rope and the geyser? No, because the fissure? a puzzle piece. Oh, oh, but what's 51 plus 37? Uh, 88. 88. Is there an 88? Because that's a puzzle piece. Right. And that's where we're at right now. There is an there. 88. All right. Yeah, this looks interesting. At the top of the cliff, you find a stone slab. Arrows have been drawn with chalk sticks. Get rid of 37. Mm -hmm. Okay. Chopsticks. <laughs> what is that card? 88? Mm -hmm. Only one of these colors will be useful, but which one of them? White. Right? What colors? Well, there, we found the white. I'm going to say the red because the handprint's in red. What is that? Drawn and I don't know. I it's don't know. What that is. Or is that chalk. a triceratops blood? Yeah, that does not say. Are you trying to guess a color? Let's get a hint. Hmm. Challenger used a white chalk stick to help yes. you. Follow the color arrows. They form a symbol. Then pair it with the inscriptions in the desert. Those inscriptions. Oh, this make this does yes. something. So right. the white arrows are what we're supposed to follow, and it forms a symbol. Is there for a rose? Hmm. Take me four minutes just to pick it up. Thank you. You can't see. You can't <laughs> see. All right. So down, <laughs> over, this way. So it's like oh, a. Yeah, it's an eight. It's like a, a yeah, hourglass. I like an hourglass. So three. How many numbers is that? Two, three, four, five, six. Three, six. Four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. Three, six, seven, four. What was she? No, that's a code. A code. Three, six. Four. Where is that at? Because we have five. to be there. In what location? Oh. Uh, um, that location, yeah. Going over. Going over. So it was three. Three, six, seven, five. Four. Eight six seven five three. Three six seven four. Three six seven four. Yes. The show the stone shows you a path in the desert. Take card thirty one. Discard seventy five, eighty eight, and ninety three. Awesome. Thirty one. Thirty one. All right. All right. No, there's no thirty one. Huh? You said card thirty one. Yeah. Yeah. I don't have a card 31. Damn it. Did the dog eat it? Probably. Now we're on borrowed time. Okay. What's the hit for 31? Nothing to report. <laughs> Here. It was that order. <laughs> oh, Village of the Desert People. Okay. So we need card 76 as well. And 90. And 90. 76 and 90. Christopher. Okay. We have, we're out of time. Did the, the app end? No, because we talked too much. What, 36 and 90? What? Yeah. 76 and 90. Okay. <laughs> We're all dead. We're all dead. We didn't save Ned. They killed everyone. We're dead. <laughs> Ned Stark always dies at the end. Or beginning. All right. We found some bowls that contain plants and an old uh, pirogue, which I guess is another canoe. word for it's a canoe. canoe. It, it, let's not get fancy with it. It's a canoe. But I bet you that canoe will help us across the uh, ginormous lake. It could. Well, but we'll never know because we're dead. 60 minutes is over. Okay. 60 minutes is up.
So what happens when we die? Does it tell you the app? So because we introduced the game, we're not technically at an hour. But if you were technically at an hour, it would alert you. You can still play to the finish. Mm -hmm. You just didn't actually win. So. I think the there's different levels of winning if you played it on out, right? Yeah, there's points. Mm -hmm. So you would get more points if you finish within the time frame. You get less points if you don't. Yeah. And plus, if you rescue other people, or other people along them. the way, yeah, yeah, they're dead. <clears throat> well, that's unlock, and <laughs> we were highly uh, successful, unsuccessful, successful at demonstrating the mechanics of the game. More so, what <laughs> not to do. Well, did, so did we have a good time? Though? I had a great yeah. time. I hope you all had a great time. Uh, let's talk about next week. Next week, we're going to have. Our episode about the new Robert Pattinson movie, The Batman, which I'm totally looking forward Obviously. to. Look at I'm shaking. Obviously. Into yeah, it. I'm a huge Batman fan, and um, I cannot wait for this movie. It looks dark. It looks gritty. It looks super cool. Um, so we'll talk about it um, next week. We've got some special guests. we got Bill Mulligan, who's our film track director at Con Carolinas. He'll be joining us. And um, one of my buddies, Carter, is going to join us, too, because he knows a lot of bat facts. Um, so that's the panel. And, of course, Rachel will join me will be there. and we'll host that thing. And, um, yeah, I'll, I'll pretty much gush for an hour on how Batman is just the best superhero ever. Um, we'll but go with that. in any case, uh, we'll be right back here with you next week at 8 o'clock on... Uh, same bad time, same, same bad, bad channel. <laughs> yeah, you had to get in there. Right, right. So why not? And um, we're going to be here, right here on Con Carolina's television, on Twitch uh, TV, The Dondero. So we please, can't wait to see you please guys. join us. And um, we'll go, to, go ahead. Go to www.concarolinas.org. Uh, if you want to run some games at Con Carolina, sign up to be a game master. Help us have a good time playing games all weekend long at Con Carolinas. And and you, you, you get something for Good doing plan. that. So, yeah, call and get some details or sign up and get some details on the computer. And, yeah, comicmonstore.com for ordering this particular game or any other game you want to get from uh, from the Comic Monstore. And um, that's about it. So uh, until next week, uh, peace and love. Thank you, guys.